Ah, uh, we're at another place. What's your name exactly? Mel Faltenham. Mel, we're at Mel Faltenham's place. He came to the car show last year <coughs> and uh, didn't get to meet him there personally, but I'm, I'm talking to him right now at the present moment. Um, he brought in this GTO. What year is this? 68. 68, 68 GTO. I'm um, kind of oh, beautiful. Beautiful. Very nice. Um, what we're here for is to look at his cars, but we're really here to look at this one right here. It's a 1935 Grand. Uh, from what I understand, it probably probably hauled a bit of moonshine its day. But uh, I really enjoy the shape that it's in. Uh, this car is a Grand. And when you open the doors, it's not like a Chev or a or an Oldsmobile. It's not full of wood. The door inside the doors are all metal. All the lips are there. It's got brand new tires on it. Uh, the interior's up here. In the in the top here, he's got all the parts for it. So what is what is going on is it's, it's the car is up for up for grabs, and uh, we're here to look at it. And the reason we're here to look at it because you can't buy it on the internet. You have to go look at it, or you can, but you're big buying a pig in a bag, you know. And, and I don't like buying pigs in bags. It might be a chicken. So as we're here and I'm looking at it, what a fantastic car it is! Fantastic. I love I love the roof shape of it. I love how low the roof is on it. Um, I like, I like it all. I like uh, the suicide doors on it. I like that there's no rust on it. It's been gone through, you know, top to bottom. Uh, it's not been done by another shop, obviously, many years ago, but they did a fantastic job on it. I don't know what else to say other than that. The car was torn apart and never put back together. Nesmi and Jolene are here looking at it. That is what we're doing. We're looking at it and we're trying to decipher in our brain whether if we buy it, how much time it'll take to fix it, what's it worth, um, or would you keep it original, would you do all that sort of stuff. You can come around the back and take a look at it a little bit. It had a continental thing on the back. Uh, I don't, I've never seen any grams up close, I don't think. Maybe one or two at a museum, maybe. Other than this, it's, a, it's, quite, it's quite something. Uh, the doors click nice, it's got a split bumper in the front. Uh, Camaro thought it had a split bumper in the 60s or 70s or 70s. And uh, here, this has got a split bumper in the 1935. This car has got, look at the body lines on it. Uh, one, two, three, four, beautiful. Like, beautiful. I can't say much more about it than that. I really enjoy the shape of the hood, how it comes back like a heart. I, I like that it's got, you know, the vent in the front. The grill is nice. I like how the fenders come down around to the front. It's got more shape to it than most, you know. You know, that all comes down in there. It's got the grill over there. It's got new running boards for it, new lights. It may, it, it's, uh, it's really nice, really nice car. We're gonna go home and think about it and think if it's in our cards. If it's in our cards, we'll, we will probably try to buy it. If it's in our cards. Um, yeah, if we could make it look half as nice as that GTO, We'd be doing something, wouldn't we, baby, huh? Mm -hmm. Huh? Isn't that beautiful? Mm-hmm. The judge. The judge never had such a nice car. Right? Yeah. Anyways, that's what we're doing this weekend. That's what we do every weekend. We go around and look at things and, and... Would a kid know what to do with that? No. No. I don't even know what it is. <laughs> you know what it is, huh? No. It's got no push buttons on it. But it's a very sexy car. It's got new white walls on it. Uh... And I like bi-spli because I like the tread. I like how the tread looks on the side. I can, it's got that pie crust, you know what I mean? It reminds you of the pies, yeah. you know, you put the, the fork in it. I used to do that for my mother, actually. When she used to bake the pies, take the fork and go around the edge. Oh, it. <laughs> <laughs> Did you get enough of the video, baby? Did you get enough of that? 